told you, you flea bitten. Oh, you're not one of my captors. Have you come to help me? The name's Paldine. A band of Khajiit kidnapped me. They're forcing me to decipher the Okudan runes on the relics they're looting. Damned grave robbers. Thing is, I think I've discovered something valuable down here. More so than wealth. I have a feeling that this is more than just another Yokudan ruin. It's massive. And the runes I have seen hint that something vital awaits inside. I need to get into the sealed inner chamber. Would you be willing to help me? Let's get moving. The ruins are just up ahead and they won't investigate themselves. Just think. I might be the first to see them since the Okudan. The first scholar, anyway. My captors wouldn't know a Okudan ruin from an Imperial vault. It's rather embarrassing. I went out to meet my, uh, lady friend, down by the west gate. Next thing I knew, someone dropped a sack over my head and knocked me out cold. When I woke up, I was a prisoner. They cleared away a cave-in from the North Passage, and there was the city. Of course, the first few that entered were skewered by traps, or eaten by scarabs and gargoyles. This serves them right. Most of my people prize strength of arms and a sharp sword. I prefer scholastic ability and a sharp wit. We should get moving. They check on me pretty often. Constructions frequently featured descriptive tablets for pilgrims. With any luck, we'll find one still intact. 
Look at this. Give me a moment. This is extraordinary. If I'm reading this correctly, the Natotambu are buried here. Those were the ancient kings of Yokuda. I think I know what we need to do. Come speak to me when you're ready. This is incredible. I'm surprised the Khajiit didn't ask me to translate this text. It's not encrusted in gold or gems, so they may not have recognized its value. According to the tablet, the eyes of Yukuda are here in the city. Legend has it that these three gemstones open the door to the Yokudan archive. If I'm correct, the archive might hold the fabled cartulary of the tamed dunes. The tablet mentions three areas. The gauntlet, the lair, and the ruin. I don't know what those are, but they don't sound very inviting. Watch for monsters and traps. You'll probably find both. When you've got the eyes, meet me by the archive.
This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Thank you for making this possible, my friend. Now let's move. This ruin isn't going to study itself. Remarkable. I, my father's blade, 
Is that a spirit? Perhaps. Perhaps it knows where the cartulary is. Let's get it and get out of here. This place is lost to time, Wanderer. You could never understand its significance. I am the vestige of a king chosen to serve on the First Council. We came to Volenfell long ago and thought it our duty to tame this wild land. Why are you here, Wanderer? What makes you worthy of such a relic? Any common thief could make it this far. Only someone truly worthy may take the cartulary from its resting place. The warrior wave of our fleet, the great regatta, sailed to this land in ages past. We are a people of strong and noble heritage. To earn our respect, you must succeed at a trial of combat, of kingship, or of bloodlines. Choose now. This trial is not for you. You are not a descendant of the Regatta. Was it this Paldine who overcame the dangers? Who battled the Guardians? Who risked life and limb to stand before me? No. You are the focus of these trials, not Paldine. Do you now? You are either confident or arrogant. It matters little. Great kings are often both. Tell me, Wanderer, how would you use the secrets of the Cartulary? A true king knows that strength is often found in humility. We foster our people because they, in turn, make us stronger. A king is nothing if he is not beloved. Your answer satisfies me. The cartulary is yours to claim. Farewell, wanderer. We shall not meet again. Magnificent. That couldn't have gone better. I'm taking this straight to King Faharajad in Sentinel. It will take time to translate all of this, but the results will be worth it. You made this all possible. Thank you, my friend. This is going to change the fate of my people, friend. I'll take this to Sentinel immediately. Oh my, I'm not sure I can think that far ahead. So many variables. What will the King's reaction be? What sort of staff will I be given? How many academic summits will I be asked to speak at? So many variables. To be honest, I don't know. But it was guarded by the ghost of an ancient king. Things like that tend to be important.
I grow tired of excuses, Narina. When will Tavo return? What do you want? Harassing? I'm collecting on a debt. I gave this woman's husband enough coin to outfit his expedition in return for a number of valuable artifacts. Now he's run off with my money. Splendid. Then this won't be a total loss. Hand them over, and I'll consider Tavo's debt paid in full. Easy now, friend. No need for violence. Yes, I see your point. Forgive me, Narina. Consider Tavo's debt forgiven. I'll leave you to your grief. Thank you. You didn't have to come to my defense, but I am grateful. I don't know what to say. You bring gifts from the gods in my time of sorrow. I have nothing left, so these will help a lot. After I've mourned my husband, I'll sell them and use the money to leave this place. It holds too many bad memories. Tavo invested in a speculative prospecting expedition. They didn't even find enough gold to pay the diggers. We lost everything. The lost city was just a rumor, but we were desperate. Yambira loaned us the money and... Well, you know the rest. With these relics, I should be able to start a new life. It will be bittersweet without my beloved, but it is what he would want. Life in the desert is harsh. One cannot grieve for long or the sands will swallow them whole.